Oh, Ziggy Stardust. Is this the great Ziggini? I don't know. We'll find out. Nice TV advantage, although it gives him a wizard, of course. Oh, it's Zygmund. I see. He's got 11 men's. He's got a block bull. He's got a wrestle hob and one guard. So this is a very nice matchup. The only the only fly in the ointment is going to be the uh, the wizard, isn't it? And uh, the wizard will be gunning for best Fagor, unfortunately. <laughs> Might, I guess, try to level this other Fagor. Uh, or maybe this Fagor. Maybe try to level a different Fagor so that he eats the lightning bolt. Um, we'll see. Our AVRS can't be good enough. Right, I get it, yeah. It's a rule that never fails. <laughs> Fair enough. I I was a bit slow there. I didn't even realise. I wasn't even uh, Night Fargo, yeah, Night Fargo was uh, was was a force to be reckoned with in that match. No, I've I've got no idea whether AVR is good or not. It was just it was just an example of any eighteen sixty T V chaos team. You lose the coin toss to that team, you're probably gonna lose the game at high TV. Which is just pathetic, isn't it really? Like it is pathetic for bash teams especially. Like at least a, an elf team can still try and get the ball off them, use the wizard, whatever. Still got a chance, but what happens with chaos is despite them being worse at low TV, at low TV you can actually play Blood Bowl and win games. But at high TV, the bash mirrors are just whoever wins the coin toss wins, pretty much. Or whoever rolls better on dice wins, pretty much. Which is it's a bit of shit, isn't it? Oh, he's got a nobbler and a wizard. All right. Yeah, it, I wasn't. I wasn't dissing him at all. It was just an example of uh, if you face this, like obviously, he, 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 chances are he's not crap because he is near the top. But it's just, the 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 only thing was an eighteen sixty chaos team, which I could face at the moment. I could just play his team and just get crushed. And but even if we were equal TV, you know, even even if. It was my chaos playoff team against his, you know. If I lose the toss, I'm just probably going to lose, aren't I? Which is why the chaos team didn't have such a great record. So yeah, I do find strangely, chaos sucking at low TV get a better record than a high TV. Crazy, eh? Or oh, tozzy at all? That is that is really fucking crazy. That, that when chaos are at their worst is when I find they do best. God, this thing's really loud outside. Um, I guess I do want to receive and then see what happens with his wizard. Get it out of the way. Ah, maybe I should have kicked. Maybe I should have kicked because then he might have been tempted to use the wizard on offense. Yeah, exactly. Lemon is good. The it was a slight. It was a slight. Um, <laughs> yeah, wrong, wrong, wrong chat free. Yeah. Um, Hello, and uh, yeah, exactly, you don't have to win the toss, but yeah, okay, the dice decide it then. The dice can just pretty much decide the game, way more than they can at low TV. Despite the, uh, despite obviously not having block and everything, I think the positioning and stuff matters a lot more at low TV. Whereas at high TV, it is simply two dice block with claw palm, see what happens. And then the only coaching skill at high TV, bash mirrors, becomes... Do you do you put your mighty blow piling on players on the line and block with them, or do you just not block with them? <laughs> um, because because reasons. <laughs> I, uh, that's that's, that's got to be the funniest thing ever, though. Just not blocking with palm, and not blocking with uh, claw palm. Like, I don't understand why we wouldn't, but there you go. One, two, three, four, five, six. So I can get quite protected with a blitz. All right. Glorious. More 
more salt for the salt god. <laughs> salt for the salt throne. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, salt for the salt throne. Yeah, that's good, isn't it? Um, thank you very much, Noffa. Thanks for staying fantastic. Oh yeah. Thank you very much for the resub. Danke schön. I could three dice there pretty easily, so maybe the, the, maybe the main blow should be here for the three dice. And then he can potentially block all blitz, depending on what happens. He is exposed to a blitz if uh, a bull centaur blitz if he gets a blitz, but no. Nah. If he does, he does. If he dies, he dies. I guess these don't need to be on the LOS. Yeah, No Fagor can carry if, uh, in case of the wizard. All right. Now, if he gets the blitz, he'll blitz him and flood through. So maybe if he goes to the side, I'm fucked, Anna. But these can go here and do something. Right. It's about as anti-blitz as it gets, I think. Many <laughs> enemy teams like to deal with these. Oh my. <laughs> nice. Outrageous. Didn't get fucked on. Oh my god, he even got the touch back. Right, he's just getting it in case of wizard. This is going well. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay, so he wants to go here, doesn't he? To keep a high line. And then I think they just. He just two dice blocks here. Forward. With block. More reliable, isn't it? I guess I could blitz then assist. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, and then six. Oh, no, I'd have to dodge. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and then he can three dice. Three, four, five, six. Hmm, but I'd have to expose the ball a little bit. Not really. Okay. Let's do this one. Keep him dominated by the guard. So he's five. So yeah, he blitzes there. Movement seven coming into effect again. Oh, yes, get fucking banged on. Blowing Doe's mind with that play there. Blocking, blocking with your guy most likely to cause a casualty. Um, I guess go here so that you can't fire ball four. Oh, yeah. oh, that was pretty good. Some safe moves first, and and get three dices in. That was pretty good. Nah. 
Uh, mighty blow, claw or mighty blow was needed, wasn't it? It was claw or mighty blow. Uh, Tosiodor. It was a nine, so mighty blow or claw would have made it. Uh, he did efficient fireball. Okay. Maybe he's gonna concede. Maybe he's maybe he's pulling a pulling a Devo. <laughs> <laughs> I just learnt about that the other night. I can't, be I can't believe he done this. That was unbelievable, wasn't it? He's gonna go straight in for the blitz. Oh my god! What a mad cunt! All right, can live with stunned. He didn't know. He didn't. He didn't fireball. He might. He might still. He's done his fireball. He's done his blitz. Now he can do his foul and concede if he wants to be as good as Andy Devo. Yep. He's done. He's done a Devo. <laughs> oh my God! Unbelievable. He's done a Devo. There you go. <laughs> Except he didn't do the concede first. For he didn't do the he didn't do the foul first. But still. Um, I'll take that. <laughs> Easy win. And two level ups. Pretty good. <laughs> Call the crops. <laughs> um. Alright. Two levels. Let's go. Ooh, double. I mean, could be. I did go high pitched again. What the fuck is this? Uh, there's only, there's been four concession wins now. Thanks, Lil Baz. That was a hard fought victory, wasn't it? Movement. I can't have two movement fagors. Can't can't have two movement fagors. The bludge. The bludge would be like the thing is you want bludge on the carrier, don't you? So having a movement guy. I want the movement guy to be the carrier. So um, it's pretty tough. Okay, I'm just gonna have to. Uh, I think I'm gonna have to mute for a minute now. Oh, I don't know what to do. That was bad timing. Right. Be right back. Nah, I, I don't like that, Shawnee. I really don't like having excessive bludge. Like, bludge guard is good, but I wouldn't want him any more than bludge guard, um, to be honest. I, I think I just like bludge on the ball carrier, personally. Um, okay, so the... And no one's died. That's the craziest thing about this team. Normally, um, you know, I've got the, got the upgrade and the, and the enhancement and just still have money like that's unheard of um so i guess i have to get four cheerleaders and uh sacrifice them to corn who i imagine is you know i'm pretty sure he's the god that this team's going to worship just feed them to the beast man seems good Right. So yeah, it's tough. I, I mean, yeah, bl bludge is decent utility, obviously, but it's a lot of TV, isn't it? And and I think low TV. You want to be TV efficient. 
I mean, the other guy's just got to get block. He could get guard first, but I guess he's just got to get block. There's, there's no real choice here. He has, he just has to get block. Um. And he could get frenzy as well. Then, then I've got a wrestle guy and a frenzy guy to get blodgers down. I wouldn't hate it, but frenzy is a nega trait as well, isn't it? That's the that's the problem. Um, yeah, you might just get match five hundred TV down, anyways. That's true. That is true. Not the stand firm. Not on a beast man. No epiphany. No. Much more rather have blodge guard two heads on a beast man, so he can he can dodge around and do stuff. Um, you know, mobile mobile guard. Um, the thing is, Blodge is good if you get multiple of them, but it's just wor it's that much worse when you face somebody like Chorfs or uh, Dwarves, isn't it? Um, Frenzy on the movement guy would be all right. I mean, Dodge would be all right. It wouldn't be bad, but I think Block Guard is better than Block Dodge. That's the problem. So then you could say that Block Dodge Guard is better than Block Guard Mighty Blow, but I think Block... Block guard is way better than block dodge. That's the problem that I have with taking dodge early. If he had block guard, I'd take dodge instantly. Well, that's one thing about frenzy, see, because frenzy is like the poor man's tackle, isn't it? And then, then you've got a bit of something to deal with with dodgers um, without going crazy on it. Um, and you could just go mighty blow, and you could you could just take mighty blow and start becoming a killer. But yeah, get, tackle's a really long road to killer. If you go tackle first, like if I was gonna, I mean, I do want a second killer. So, you know, he could just go mighty blow and then tackle as his third skill. It's that it's interesting. It's a tough. It's a tough. Uh, it's a tough question. That to be honest. But anyway, I'll wrap up the video for the YouTubes. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed, it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.